pulling from the blues, from the oranges. Artist Omari Booker tells stories on canvas of North Nashville, of Jefferson Street. As an artist, you're, you just have your eyes open and you're, you're looking at what's going on around you. And there's a lot to see. A jam session at Jefferson Street Sound. <laughs> A chessboard set up at Headliner's Barbershop. No, no. Yeah. The old clubs played host to the greats, Little Richard, B.B. King, Jimi Hendrix, Ike, and Tina Turner. Yeah, I hope to be able to kind of paint the way that I see it. That's colorful and energetic, a lot of love. It's a very uh, special place. But for a sense of true history in his storytelling, Omari knew he'd have to find someone with deep family ties to Jefferson Street. I am fourth generation, a family that has lived here. Our great-grandparents purchased it in 1920, 2518 Jefferson Street. Elois Freeman remembers a very different Jefferson Street from her childhood. There was a drug store at one point, hardware store, your movie theater, everything. We had the self-contained community, especially in a segregated world. Well, it used to be quieter. <laughs> The memories tend to come flooding back, sharing a porch with Barton Harris. Lois is my sister, older sister. <laughs> they were young children during the Nashville sit-ins when people worked to end the segregation of lunch counters downtown. Some of those sit-ins were planned from inside the homes on Jefferson Street. The elders in the neighborhood are the ones that have experienced it in a really, really visceral way. As, as younger people, we just, it's our job to listen and continue to tell that story. But what changed Elois and Barton's world came with the arrival of I-40. It split the African-American black community up. Separated us from our schools. At that time, you felt it, that you're disregarded, that you're being attacked. Today. Eloa still sees barbershops, beauty shops, schools, and education. But her neighborhood, as she knows it, is changing again. That progress means pushing some out. The people who've been here, who've had the heritage, that's your wealth. That's your wealth. That's your wealth. The offers have been coming in to buy up 2518 Jefferson Street. Everything's not about money. It's about your soul. It's about your family. There are many who are saying no. And so we're amongst those. And in that, Omari found a story to tell and had an opportunity for it to be seen by many. An exhibit at the Frist Art Museum shares murals of North Nashville artists. Omari's piece is created of razor wire, of building materials. It features a familiar face sitting on a porch. I'm usually inspired to try to tell some story that will help push community forward. So the identification ended up being that issue. In the midst of all the social changes, economic changes, this house represents stability. And Eloa says that light will stay on here at 2518 Jefferson Street. And we're on. That was a gift to me, and she is a gift to, to all of Nashville. And I'm grateful. We are